Robert Burns uh, wrapped up New Year once and for all, circa 1788, and Old Lang Syne has pretty much had a hammerlock on the festivities ever since then. This is really the only viable alternative to Old Lang Syne, even though its composer vehemently insisted that it wasn't a New Year song at all. It was written in 1947 by Frank Lesser, and Lesser got very annoyed when it started turning up on Christmas albums uh, as a seasonal song. As he saw it, the key to the whole thing was the first line of the chorus. Maybe it's much too early in the game. In other words, it's boy meets girl, late April, early May. Uh, you think maybe she's the one, but you don't know, and you're looking down the road, and you're wondering whether you'll still be together when the clock strikes 12 on December the 31st. Uh, Frank Lesser is a very great songwriter. Guys and Dolls, Heart and Soul, Slow Boat to China. But sometimes a great songwriter can be wrong, even about his own work. And the song wiggles free of its creator, and listeners across the decades hear things in the song that the author never intended. A new Year can be an awful time to be lonely, and it turned out there was a huge unserved market out there for a big, romantic New Year love song. I especially love uh, this rather spooky verse, and we're going to set it up with uh, Pete Callard and a tip of the hat to Robbie Burns. Pete.
ever be the one you chose Out of a thousand invitations you receive What are you doing, New Year's? What are you doing, New Year's song from Me To You, Words and Music by Frank Lesser and my thanks to Pete and to Jeff Eels at the piano and the rest of the gang. Uh, my old pal, the best-selling novelist Sebastian Folks, has a scene in his book, A Week in December, in which a London society hostess bemoans the way that these ghastly Americans insist on referring to New Year's apostrophe S. So that's just for you, Sebastian. What are you doing New Year's? It's always a jackpot question. Nobody knows what the chimes of midnight will bring, but I wish you and yours only the best for the 12 months ahead, and we will see you in the bright new dawn of January. Happy New Year's! <laughs>